Welcome to our lecture online. In this video, we're going to visit some additional terms, starting with the term congruent. But we're also going to look at postulate, axiom, theorem, and distance. So first, congruent. You might have heard that term, but what does it really mean? Well, one meaning for the term is that if we have two line segments, and both line segments have the same length, they are congruent. I think we've also heard that when we use it with triangles, when two triangles are congruent. So that means when the ratios of the side are the same, but we'll see that later. But here, simply, when we're dealing with line segments, if the two line segments have the same length, and the line segments do not need, need to be parallel to one another, then those two line segments are congruent. That means they have the same length. The term postulate or axiom is a rule that is accepted without proof. You can simply look at it and surmise, yes, that makes sense, that must be true, we don't need to prove it. A theorem is something different. A theorem is a rule that is verified with a proof. Somebody comes up with a theorem and then we look for a way to prove that theorem so that that theorem then basically becomes a fact once it's been proven. So again, these are different ways in which we establish rules in geometry. And then we have the, the, the word distance. In geometry, the distance is the absolute value between two points. Two points on line, for example. Let's say we have a, a ray here. We have the point A, the point B. The distance between them is defined as A minus B. The value for A minus the value for B, if this was, for example, on a number line. And since we're taking the absolute value, we can switch them around. We go a minus b, take the absolute value, must equal to the absolute value of b minus a. That's called a distance. And yes, we can say it, we can describe it like this, simply by writing a, b without the line on top. That then signifies the distance between those two points on that line. And here we have what we call the addition postulate. Remember, the postulate is a rule that we don't need to prove. Here what we're saying is that we have three, po three points on this line, and if we take the distance from A to B, and then we take the distance from B to C, and then we add those two distances, we get the distance from A to C. That appears to be true by just simply looking at it. We do not need to prove that. And so here we have then the definition of these five terms. Notice that axiom and postulate are basically the same thing. It's simply a rule that we do not need to prove. A theorem is something we look for to prove, and the distance is simply the absolute value of the, of the difference between the two points. If this was on a number line, and A was, for example, 2, and B was 6, and C was 8, then you can see that 2 minus 6 is a minus 4. We take the absolute value, we get 4. 6 minus 2 is 4. We take the absolute value, we get 4. So 4 is simply the distance between A and B. So if the distance between A and B is 4, and the distance between B and C is, six, uh, is 2, because 8 minus 6 is 2, then you know that when you add these two up together, you get the distance between A and C, and that doesn't need to be proven. That becomes quite clear. And those are the definitions of these five additional terms.